Good morning. Coming at you this morning from Colmont OHV. Uh, we're actually up here for kind of a benefit ride or event. It's not so much of a ride, but we've got a, a whole event going on for one of my friends that was in a bit of an accident a couple months ago. So we're just bringing it all together for him. <clears throat> so I guess we are headed out to a little place called Flat Rock. Headed out with some of the Alpha Whiskey guys. Uh, and I don't know, I've never been I've never done much of anything here at Colmont. I've been all over and up and down through the cove, and that's just right next door to Colmont, but I haven't been through Colmont. So we're going to some place called Flat Rock. It's supposed to be real pretty, so we'll get some footage along the way. See you in a minute. So we are now at Flat Rock. Uh, we got a whole bunch of kids playing in the water right here. We've got like a thousand people taking videos and pictures and everybody's happy. And we got a Jeep over there that's not making it up the hill. Got a Jeep over there that's gonna fall down the hill. It's all happiness.
So I guess that's all the fun for Flat Rock. We are, uh, you can see we're all kind of regathering and we're gonna head back up the trail, back to the pavilion, get on festivities. I, I hear there's gonna be a, like a catfish fry up there. I, I'm, you know, my fat is looking, I can't say that. You know I'm chonky. You know I want that catfish. So, so I am here with Terry. Now Terry is, are you the founder? So unfortunately, I was learning how to use a new camera here and I had the audio set up wrong. So all of the audio from this is really horrible. <laughs> you can't really hear anything that's going on. So I just thought I'd give a quick description here. Wheeling with Warriors, they are a group based out of Bowling Green, Kentucky. And what they do is they put on a lot of benefit events like, like what you're seeing here, where they've got a fish fry going and they're cooking up and everything that they do here is for whatever specific charity it is. Uh, these guys will actually get together with veterans and they will take them out on rides, do everything they can to kind of get them out of the house and get them back into enjoying life. I think it's a fantastic thing that these guys are doing. I'll drop a link down below in the comments. Uh, and of course, I've got one up here on the screen. You should check these guys out. Talking to Terry here, he is just a, an awesome individual. Uh, and the, the whole crew, there's a, a bunch of them out there. But I really believe in these guys. Uh, you can find them on Facebook, Wheeling with Warriors. Check them out. 
uh, and everything was going real well here until Charlie walked in front of the camera, uh, and uh, I don't I don't know, but uh, after that it all kind of went went uh, went downhill. But I'm sorry. <laughs> So good morning. So last morning here at camp, just kind of getting closed up. Just wanted to point out how fantastic that San Hema Hotham tent has been. Very comfortable. Lots of room, like with this with this kick out up here. It's got great big windows. It's been really nice being able to look out, see the whole skyline view of camp. And that little teeny tiny set power fridge, just for me for the what, what I've been on here for for two days now. It's perfect. It tucks away like you can see the back of the truck fills up real fast. So having something real small to just be able to tuck away like that and be able to get all kinds of stuff on the other side, keeps everything cool that I need cool. I've got my drinks in there. I've got my uh, my meats in there for making sandwiches, whatever. It's awesome. If I'd have had to bring one of my big, one of my full size fridges, this would have been a completely different deal. Like packing would have been different. Maybe I'd have been able to, to get everything in there exactly the same, but it would have been a lot more challenging. So, so if you haven't seen the review on either that tent or this refrigerator, just check out my channel, you'll find them there. And even if you're not interested in looking at the reviews, don't be shy to buy a small fridge, right? Just for one person. They're so affordable and it saves so much room. Really is worth your time and money. I'm super happy to have it. You know, here again, if, if Marla was with me and we were out for another day or two, having a larger fridge is definitely a necessity. But if it's just you for a couple days, that little guy does perfect. So, uh, we're just kind of closing out here at the Steve Melton Benefit. Uh, had an had an awesome time uh, with all my boys that are up here, uh, even the guy in the CRV who just showed up. I didn't, I didn't know we we're bringing CRVs out here anyway. Eh, well, you know, kid holler. <sighs> yeah. Somebody's got to have babies. That is not me. So, like I said earlier in the video, I'll drop a link down below. You could probably see it down at the bottom of the screen right now. If there's anything you can do to help out, give a dollar, give five dollars, ten bucks, whatever it is. Uh, the cause is fantastic. Steve is one of the nicest, most genuine human beings you'll ever meet. Uh, give the shirt off his back to you. Never met anybody who didn't like the guy. Never met anybody who was like, that guy's a jerk. Like, never, not, not one. Uh, and everybody, you come out here, everybody knows him. You come out to the Cove, you come out here to Colmont, and it's like he's just built into the scenery. Like, everybody knows the guy. Yeah, yeah, I saw he was over there in a samurai, or now he's got a forerunner going on. Um, but anyway. Whatever you can do to help them out, we genuinely appreciate it. Uh, so far, I think we've, we've had a good time this weekend. I have, it's been a blast. Uh, actually, instead of being on trails yesterday, we spent the day running the, uh, running the show and was able to see a really amazing response from the community here. Um, we drove in from Texas because we knew Steve, we know the rest of the guys that he runs with. We even had a guy show up from like three hours out that didn't even know Steve. <laughs> Showed up, gave a hundred bucks, was like, oh, I guess I'll hang out a little while and goes home. So it's been really fun to watch the community come behind a guy who made it possible for them to be here. Mm -hmm. um, because, you know, Steve was instrumental in getting Colmont OHV on the map. I don't yeah. know how many people know that. So they worked almost almost three decades to get that done. And he's done a whole lot of other stuff. He served our country to make sure that we still get to do this kind of stuff. And it was just a, an amazing time to get to see, like, people just come together and, like, yeah. have a good time and still be able to provide a way for his family to have a little more breathing room as he's going through his healing process. It was yeah. pretty awesome. Yeah, it was it was great. I got to I got to say I, I was a little bit bombed up. So I drove all the way out here from South Carolina. My man Mike here came all the way from Texas. Turns out he drove farther than I did. Uh, they were giving away like the the whoever came the farthest got a big bottle of whiskey and he's taking it home and I, I thought it was going to be mine. But I'll send him pictures of the cup when I take it. So just just bragging, that's all it is. Yeah. Um yeah, I'd expect you to do the same to me. Well, I absolutely would. Absolutely. I might even send them pictures of whiskey anyway, just for no reason. Just right. like, haha. Uh -huh. So yeah, check that out. Also, remember to check out Wheeling with Warriors, because they're doing awesome things as well. Um, and then come on back and see us again. I appreciate you watching. I appreciate any amount that anybody has donated, any one of my viewers out there. Hit you right there in the heart. Uh, I really yeah. appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. Yeah, for sure. Thank you.